Holy cow, what is that infernal machine? You guess it, it belongs to this ancient telephone. These Bakelite phones were manufactured from 1948 to 1961 and were the only available phones in Germany during that period. In this video I will look on what's inside and find out how it works and if we can still use this monster thing in 2021. So stay tuned for that. The younger among you may be missing a touch screen here. Oh wait, there is an LCD display. We can take it out and have a closer look. Oh no, it's just a piece of plastic and cardboard. Probably to write the firefighter's number or something like that on. In fact, the only elements to operate it are a white push button and the dial. And this is how it's done. To call someone, pick up the handset and put your finger in the hole for the number you want. Turn it clockwise until your finger reaches the end stop and pull your finger out to release it. Enjoy the nice rattling sound it makes. Repeat until you have dialed all the digits on of the phone number. There is no phone book or Alexa to do the work of dialing for you. An international call with country code, area code and phone number can easily have 10 or more digits. It can make your fingers bleed by the time you are done dialing. Life was dangerous back in the 1950s. Some of these phones had an additional push button. With this you could use special function of the exchange, for example the transfer of calls from the secretary to the boss. So this one was probably used in an office. Also note that these phones had a cord that came out the backside and had to be plugged into a wall jack. There was no way to take it with you and make calls on the go. Now let's unscrew it to take a look at its inner workings. There are two screws there, which I now turn out. Then the upper part easily comes off and reveals the technology hidden inside. The first thing you will notice are the two large bells. These are struck by a clapper that is moved to the right and left by two magnets, thus striking the bells alternately. It's hardly visible, but the left bell is slightly smaller than the right one and therefore emits a slightly higher pitched tone. Telephone bells are driven by an alternating current of 60 volts and 25 hertz. And so this one sounds like this. Above there is the switch for the handset. All made from brass and all hand soldered. A bit like steampunk. Now I will take a look at the rotary dial. When you turn it, it tensions a spring that, when released, drives a mechanism that alternately opens and closes a contact. As many times as it corresponds to the number dialed. A centrifugal governor ensures that the dial always rotates at the right speed. And this is how it looks on the scope when you dial a number. The switching center now counts the pulses and knows immediately which number you have dialed. This process is called pulse dialing. When the push button telephones came along, it was replaced by the much faster tone dialing method. Now to the handset. You could easily twist it open to replace the microphone or speaker. All parts are easy to reach, repair and replace. And all it takes is a screwdriver. I am curious whether we can still use this telephone nowadays. The public analog landline telephone system has already been replaced by voice over IP and mobile in many areas. And even if you still have a landline, it must still be able to handle pulse dialing. Otherwise you can be called, but you can't call anyone yourself. But if you own a wireless router with phone ports like this one here, it should be possible. Let's try it out. Because I already had the phone in use myself, it has a matching plug which I put into the right socket at the back of the device. I have tapped into the telephone line where it enters the phone and blocked the DC voltage component with a small 100 nanofarad capacitor. 
It then goes into the microphone input of my old laptop where I record with Audacity what is heard on the line. Now I try to call the old phone with a modern one. Hello? If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell so you will never miss anything which I will do in the future. With that being said, I now try the other way around. Obviously, this does not sound like a success. Because you've been watching for so long, I'll show you a trick to call someone anyway. With a DTMF tone generator app, you can easily generate the dial tone. Type the number you want to call into your cell phone and hold it up to the handset. Because this is a German Wellfernsprecher 48, I call the time announcement in Germany. Willkommen bei der Zeitansage der Telekom Deutschland. Guten Tag, heute ist Donnerstag, der 17. Juni 2021. Beim nächsten Ton ist es 14 Uhr, 40 Minuten und 0 Sekunden. That's awesome, isn't it? Okay, that's all about it for now. All that's left to say is... Thanks for watching and see you in my next video.